Okay, we got a, this is a core exchange ZF2045 axle off of a 7410. Gonna give a couple of quick pointers. Some's internal, some's external. So whether you're trying to decide if yours is good or bad, or whether you're buying one, or whether we're selling one, uh, what, it, what the, the pieces we need to check. So always the first place that we would start would be the, the pivots. Now, it may be hard to see in this video, but they heated this up to get it out. You can see where that got hot. Now the bushing's still in it, I believe. But when you go to the, this one, it's not. So the bushing here is egged out. Now, a good machine shop can fix that, and we've got machine shops that do fix it, and that's what we'll do with this one, as long as the other pieces are okay. <clears throat> so, uh, there's there's two points. So, your third point that you always want to check is here on your pinion bearing. So, these are prone to also be bad, and, you know, looking in there, I don't know if that's broken out. I see a chunk there. It may be. A lot of times, these aren't fixable because there's just not enough meat around that to fix it so while you're here you also have the inside of the you also have the inside of the pinion bearing sorry i'm the inside of the pinion bearing and then you have also this inner side so that's going to be number uh i guess it's check number five one two three four yeah number five so if all that's good, then you'll come to your um, your ends, but typically you're never bad here. Typically if you're gonna be bad, you're gonna be bad on the bottom. And the reason that is, I'll kick this over here. So if your bearings go out, you're gonna drop all your weight that's gonna drop onto your axle or on your uh, steering knuckle. So typically, if we have wear, that's where that's gonna be. I don't see any wear on that because it'll groove into it. We'll flip it over and check it to make sure. And then the last would be where your drive shaft goes in here because you got a seal that holds it in. And so, you know, we check that. Anyway, so you've got, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You got eight checks on this particular axle. I suppose you, you know, the steering cylinder may be an area to check. It's not so problematic, but uh, if you decide that uh, yours is bad, those are some things that uh, if you don't have a good machine shop, we do, you know, we have these here. And if you're buying one from whether you're buying it from us or from someone else, you'll know what to check. And that's always a good thing that you, you don't want to get the same part that you already have. So if we can help you out with this, we also do an upgrade to a heavy or duty uh, complete axle. So depending on how bad your axle is, like if your other side was bad, sometimes it makes sense to do an upgrade just because of the price point. So if we can help you out, let us know.